Hey, love bugs, it's Rosalind back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and Ali's favorite, and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, much love to and welcome. And to my returning subs, my grown extended beautiful family, just thank you so much for being there, showing love and support through the ups and the down times, and my down times, and my relaxed times. You know, I just love y'all, and y'all, you, you know, y'all keep on getting me going. So, thank you for all those blessings you send me as I do the same for you. And with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light. And many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you've been watching my videos for a while and have not already, what are you waiting for? Like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell so you know when your girl is about to upload her next video. And if you are comfortable enough, please go ahead and drop me a line or two. I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video, or you're just up telling me about your impact gift and how it impact if you like to hit you towards a positive direction and if you feel like you're um th that you get the good vibes and the good information that you get and you want to share it with a loved one or a friend y'all get tired tongue tied on that last part if you feel like you are getting good vibes or good information from the videos and want to share it with a loved one or a friend please go ahead and do so and while you're at it give me a thumbs up like and even share all your social media favorites wherever you see fit and thank you so much for stopping by the channel now if you're able to resonate with the content of my video i don't know why i got some tied on that last part i do it all the time so but anyway the meditation video that i'm listening to today is 639 hertz angelic healing choir attract love reconnecting and balancing relationships and i will post that link in the description box below and my video today is about twin flame 101 empaths when we release the inner conflict yeah when we have this inner conflict with ourselves because there are so many of us that i've been doing one-on-ones with and i've been basically doing it myself too so i'm i'm suspect of doing it too I'm, I'm i'm not no victim but i say i'm suspect when we see things that we know that we need to dig into you know that there's a lot of times that we can find out things about our lives and about ourselves that can be really shocking and make you want to clutch your imaginary pearls you know what i'm saying or just clutch something you know and it's just like some you know we fear what we don't understand we don't we feel of reject we feel we uh we fear of how people perceive us at times you know what people think even though sometimes you're like i don't care what people think but sometimes we do because i mean there's times where i was just like oh my god you know people when before i started doing live you know i i had a lot of different youtubers tell me why rosa why don't you go live why don't you go live and i'm just like uh no or even people even ask me rosa why don't you ever do live and i'm like uh-uh mm -mm. i just never did that you know because it's like it's basically like me going up in front of everybody i couldn't do that because it's so easy to do this you know right in front of my little screen where you know i'm not engaging with anybody but when i finally started doing live when God basically and universe basically pushed me towards it when I thought my computer was broke. I had no choice but to keep doing live until I could figure out, oh, okay, it wasn't actually the computer, it was just the core. So it was that blessing that when I was cut off from one electronic to where it, this is like my thing, you know, this is my therapy, and along with helping other, you know, empaths as well, you know, going through that situation where I was helping them too and I started panicking like oh my gosh you know how am I gonna be able to do my videos it was just like so many people were telling me about you know if you do it on your phone it takes so much time it you know it drags your phone out you know and all those different things so I said you know what let me just go ahead and do live and it was so good you know even though I had bumps in the road where you had ignorant people coming in but you know you always got to have that balance you know that if you push out something positive you're gonna have some folks come at you with some negative stuff that is to be expected but it's just all how you respond to it so it's just like with your inner conflict is going on it's like sometimes we're fighting ourselves for no apparent reason because we we see a mountain out of a molehill you know we 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 exaggerate sometimes like, oh my god i can't do this oh my gosh i can't do that or i'm worried about this you can't be worried about stuff like that you have to be able to step into the unknown knowing this is what you know the universe is pushing you to do we, we have to be comfortable of being uncomfortable you know if you want change you have to be able to flip it off when you you know you have to be able to flip the script sometimes when you're going towards things you have to be a little edgy 
you have to give yourself that, you know, that, you know, you have to be your own cheerleader at times. If you, even if you don't have nobody supporting you saying, yes, you can do this. You know, even when I talk to people, I give them that encouragement. You know, if you're, you're starting your own channel or you're starting your own brand, I tell them you have to come up with the ideas knowing, you know, whatever you went through, like when it comes to your, you know, your YouTube thing, even though I'm still learning, you know, this is my second year doing it, but I got more comfortable with it. You know, there's sometimes, you know, I try to, I flip out when I don't have content or I don't have enough, you know, I just think about, you know, what are, what are the things I'm going through on a daily basis The imp other empaths might be going through or what it, what for me being a twin flame. You know, what am I going through that other ones might be struggling to go through, too? And they're find, trying to find that, you know, that hope, that answer to that question. You know, because sometimes we got more questions than we do got answers. So it's just like so many different things. We can't be fighting ourselves on things that we already know we need to face. So it's just like when you go through these situations, knowing you have to go through them. Our purpose, our pain has a purpose. You know, even though it's just like, Rosalind, I'm so hurt. I had to go through this. I'm so hurt because I had to go through that. But we are not going to be the, the person we were when we first started this journey. We're going to come out somebody totally different. We're going to come out a lot, a lot stronger, more wiser, have more information to where we can be able to pass it on to others. It's just like so many people I know right now are going through so many different migraines and stuff like that. But they... They don't realize the reason why they're going through these migraines because there's something that they're blocking for themselves. There's something that they're not actually truly seeing that they needed to see. You know, there's so many people going through all these aches and pains and stuff like that because it's just like sometimes I go through the heart chakra and um, I start having these really strong emotions to where I'm screaming, like screaming, crying. You know, and I know I had to go through that because I'm releasing so much. I've been through like 40 some years, 41 years of pain, heartache, all these different things, mishaps and abuse. And there's so much stuff that I'm releasing and letting go because I got my inner power. I got that inner strength to know this is not going to last forever. I know I have to go through it and it can be annoying as hell. But I know I'm facing it, knowing that I have to have patience with myself. You know, that I mean, I, I get frustrated when I'm just like, I get mad because I can't do my videos every day. Because I'm so used to doing them every day. I haven't been this way. I was telling my girl today, I'm like, gosh, you know, I haven't been like this since I first started. But I know there's more times I have to take the breaks because these shifts are hitting me like it ain't even funny. But I'm just blessed that I have people like y'all that are watching my videos. It's like, okay, she must be going through something or she had to take a break, you know. But y'all are still coming back and watching the videos. And it's just like, now I got more people coming. So it's just like when well, we're going through so many different things, knowing we got to go through it to get to it. And we're going to come out stronger and better than ever. So it's just like I hope you're able to, you know, resonate with the content of the video. And send out as much love and light and positivity as you possibly can. Have a blessed, safe weekend. You know, send blessings to other people. You know, you're getting blessed. Go ahead and bless other people. You know, it makes you feel better. And my post notification shout out goes to, let me see, um, Miss Cynthia from S Nation. Much love to you. And thank you for all the, you know, the info that you give me as long as I give, you know, like I give you is the same. You know, we all learn off of each other. There's certain things that, you know, we can teach each other. You know, we go through all these different things and we have answers. We have questions. And then, you know, other people give us the answers that we're actually seeking. So, you know, send out as much positivity as you possibly can. You never know what you're going to get afterwards. So, much love to y'all, and I'm sending out infinite abundance, healing vibes, loving vibes, and uplifting vibes, especially to whoever needs it. Give me a thumbs up, like, and even share on your social media favorites, and know that you are truly blessed, highly favored, and forever loved, and knowing there is always somebody out there going to pray for your better days. And once again, give me a thumbs up, like, and even share on your social media favorites, wherever you see fit. Drop me a line or two. I love a chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me, even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video. Or you're just up telling me about your impact, the gift, and how it impacted your life and hit you towards a positive direction. And, you know, once again, like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell so you know when your girl's about to upload the next video. And once again, I will see y'all later. Much love. Miss y'all.
Peace, be safe, and always be wild.